Altar of the Aegis. Defeat Lord Mephenstroth and place the Aegis of Agamar upon the Altar of Internal Night. Now, unfortunately, you are actually going to have to do the dungeon for this. The, uh, whichever the hell it's called, the, not the Tomb of Sargeras, I think it's the Cathedral of Eternal Night. So, once you've completed that, which the final boss will be Mephenthos. Mephenthos? That makes it sound like meth. Like a bloody mint. Uh, Mephenstroth. One of those. We're going to go with it anyway. Once you defeated him, final boss, place the Aegis on, turn to Khadgar, job's a good one. That is pretty much it in a nutshell. Now, I'm not obviously going to run the dungeon because you doubt you want to see me running the dungeon for like 20 odd minutes or however long it's going to take me. So, I'm going to leave it there for you. Obviously, that's pretty much it. I think you can just do it on any any mode. I don't think there is such difficulty, but I have been wrong before several times, in fact. Um, let's have a look. Uh, Call of Eternal Night. Yeah, you, you can just do it on Heroic. So, yeah, once you've actually done it, you should be good to go. And there we have it.